If you want to save energy, then turn off your light in your room. Get out of your room. Sometimes it happens that you forget to turn off your light and fan in your room while you are going outside the room or going into the another room. So it is a total waste of power. Total waste. Hey, hello guys, this is Shubhabroto and welcome to our channel Circuitation. In this video, I will show you a device which turn off the light if you are getting outside of your room and turn on the light if you are entering in your room. And consider subscribe to this channel. So don't skip the video. Watch till the end. Let's get started. For making this device, I am using three parts. The first part is the PIR motion sensor, which will detect the motion of a human. The second is the relay driver board for the PIR motion sensor. And the third one is a 12 volt DC adapter for powering up the whole system. Now let's take a look on how PIR motion sensor works. This is a PIR motion sensor. If any human or animal comes in the range of this sensor, the sensor receives the infrared heat energy which is emitted by the human or the animal body. After receiving this infrared energy, the sensor gives us a output signal. Now let's see how to set up the PIR motion sensor. First, we have to set the range of this sensor which is up to 7 meter. By adjusting this potentiometer or preset you can say, you can adjust the range of this sensor. Next is the time delay setting. By adjusting the, this time delay preset, you can set the time that how much time the output will be on after detecting the motion. Its delay time can be adjusted from 0.3 second to 5 minute. And this is the last setup, mode selection. There is two modes, single trigger mode and the repeat trigger mode. In single trigger mode, output will be on for single time when motion is detected and goes off after the delay time and it takes 6 to 10 seconds to reset and in this reset time any motion is not detected by this sensor but in the repeat trigger mode output will be on until any motion is not detected but this is only mentioned in data sheet the repeat trigger mode is also work like a single trigger mode in our sensor so to solve this problem we made a circuit now let's understand this circuit when any motion is detected the circuit will turn on the relay using this transistor and also charge up the capacitor on that time and when the output signal of the sensor goes low the capacitor will supply the relay circuit to turn on and when capacitor charge is goes below the transistor base trigger voltage the relay will also turn off thus the turn off the AC load. So that is it for the circuit. Now let us see this project in action. If you like this video then make sure you hit the like button and share this video with your friends 
and uh, if you are new to this channel or seeing me for the first time then press the subscribe button and let me know in the comment section this this, this device is making worth or not and the most important thing be creative